It's about that time for BET Awards and Nigeria's Rema and Bonner Boy, um, South Africa show Mad Josie and Congolese songwriter Inosbi gets nominated for 2020 awards. Bonner Boy, Mad Josie and Inosbi were nominated alongside Dave Stubzy, Ninho and um, someone else from France in the Best International Arts category. Bonner Boy had previously won the category in 2019 while um, Rema earned a nod in Viewer's Choice that's um, Best New International Arts category. Yay, Yay. I'm happy for Rema. I'm happy for four of them. Which one? Oh, okay. <laughs> from Africa, yeah. yeah they yeah. are representing us. Nigerians. Wow. But very much specifically. I'm, I'm very I'm, happy for um, him. The, the viewer's choice, no, not the view, the one Brenner Boy is in, that is a tight, mm -hmm. very, very tight list. Mm -hmm. I, except from the guy from France, and I guess that's just because of language barrier. Mm -hmm. um, they're really strong competi um, competition, right? I think um, Shuma Josie has had a really good, good year. year. She has, that um, John Cena song was a banger. And even, it's not just John Cena, she has other, a couple of other songs that I can't, say their names i can't pronounce them well <laughs> they're all fire they're receiving her really well her personality and everything like she's doing really well for herself and then there's dave oh my gosh dave's album so i think some to me oh, it's I a bit too old for this category as really? far as yeah i nah. think in a, in a way i feel like i feel like stormzy yeah, has maybe bonaboy is old too even Bonaboy, she wasn't here last year mm. he was here he last, won year. last year yeah so i mean maybe they just don't have any other category for us but I don't know. I think Burner Boy and even um, Stormzy, but Dave, Dave, I secretly want to win. I wish he was African then. I wouldn't really have a <laughs> tug of, of war for that, but I think he's done a lot of work and he, his album was just like fantastic to me. Like, I feel like we needed the album. So, yeah. but yeah, I wish all of them the best. Rema, of course, I'm happy for Rema. I don't you know. You think he'll win? I, mm, it's, mm. I think Rema might win. It's possible. It's based Rema on votes. Rema might win, to be honest. Because when, the thing is, when you look at Rema's growth since 2019, 2019 was when he had this breakthrough, and he's already been nominated for a BET. That was like within a year. Mm -hmm. I feel like his growth is very, 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 very huge and just shows his talent. And right. the fact that he has like featured in a couple of um, international interviews and magazines, but I will think... Will they vote? It's he has a huge fan it's, base, uh, who, not just in Nigeria. Fan, the person's I, fan I think, base I is think who votes. I'm also looking at his management now and how they have mm -hmm. done regarding awards that have got to do with voting. They've always won it. Mm. Yeah. Um, I mean, even when I don't know was, anybody else, all the competition and their voting history. Because the reason why I keep saying, would they vote, is Beyonce. Every time Beyonce gets into voting category, surprisingly, she does not win. Mm. Mm. But I think Rema has huge, that huge, well. we'll huge that goes, following. So, so I, I hope I'm not surprised, but mm. um, I, I'm obviously for for that category. I'm rooting I think for I'm, Rema. I'm rooting for Rema. Of as course, well. we knew. You didn't need to say it. <laughs>